Roman Dicko, you did it in Paris. How does that feel? That's amazing. You know, the last time I, I won in Paris, it was like three years ago. So I really wanted to, to win the gold medal again here, especially this year, you know, with the Olympics in six months. So I'm very proud of me and I'm so happy to win in front of that uh, crowd. All these kids around shouting your name. What's that like? You know, that's amazing. Um, this is maybe the first time I uh, use this, all this crown with me, you know, to win uh, today. I don't know, you know, I feel a little bit um, lucky to be able to compete here, to win here in front of uh, yeah the, the French public. You've uh, had a good rivalry with Syed before. Ha you made it look easy today. What was what was what happened? I don't know. Maybe I, because of the Olympics, I, I wanted to to do like a, a good judo. I really was into my um, my I don't know techniques and my kimikata. Uh, I tried to do my best. I, I tried to 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 um, to do what I am. Try, um, working in technique with uh, my coaches so yeah I think I did great if it if it uh, that looked easy that was not that easy but at least I won so that's good <laughs> Paris is such a huge event for, for non-French judoka and French judoka tell me about the atmosphere tell me about what it's like when you walk out and the fireworks are going and everyone's cheering for you I really think and really feel that this is the best competition in the world. Uh, all the people love to compete here, even the strangers, as you said. I think it's because of the city, it's because of the atmosphere. You know, the French people are really into judo, and they really lo uh, love to um, to see a good judo, to to, to look at uh, great judo cars. So I think it's like a big salad with a lot of good ingredients, and yeah, that made it. Thank you so much, Ryan. Congratulations. Thank you so much.